everybody, it's Jenny, and today I'm sharing my cards for the Not Too Shabby Stamp and Die of the Month for the month of September. And this month includes these cute little turkeys and coordinating dies. You can find the link to this product in the description box below, as well as follow along with the rest of the hop using the hashtag N2STurkeyDay. By participating in the hop, you have a chance to win a $25 gift certificate to the Not Too Shabby Shop. And all you have to do to enter is leave a like and comment on each of the videos along the way, as well as enter at the Rafflecopter link in the description box below. So let's go ahead and take a closer peek at these cute little images. You have three turkey images, two sentiments, and some additional fall images, including a pumpkin and some leaves. And then here are the coordinating dies for all the images, including the sentiments. So to start my cards today, I'm going to go ahead and stamp out all the images onto some 80 pound Nina cardstock. After I got them all stamped out, I went ahead and colored them in with some Copic markers. Then I went ahead and used the coordinating dies to cut them all out. I brought in a bunch of different fall papers from my stash and I'm just going to go through each of these and pull out some pages that I think would work well for these cards. Using the new sketch for the month of September from Not Too Shabby, and this sketch includes a mini slimline. So once I had a nice little collection of pattern papers, I just went ahead and started laying things out and started to pair together some different pattern papers along with the images. Once I had some of the papers paired together, I started to trim things down following the sketch.
I just keep fiddling around with all the different patterns and images until I get the layouts how I like. And as per usual with most of my cards, I kind of just put things together as I go and end up swapping something out completely as you'll see here. So I changed the background entirely for the one card and then I'm moving on to the sentiments. So I had this thankful for you die cut sentiment in with my fall papers so I thought I might as well use that. And then I'm going to go ahead and stamp out the two sentiments from the set and trim those out with the dies and add those to the other two cards. Next, I wanted to add some faux stitching to each of my card fronts, so I created a template that would leave an eighth inch border and used washi tape to hold it in place while I added the faux stitching with a white gel pen. Next, I went ahead and started gluing everything down. While I was gluing things down, I also added some white dot highlights to each of my images. And now for the final step, I'm adding some black sequins to each of the card fronts. camera I'm gonna go ahead and add each of these card fronts to a card base but here are my finished cards I really love these sweet little turkey images they just look so happy for more inspiration using these cute little guys don't forget to follow the hashtag n2s turkey day and I will catch you in the next one bye